Hi, this is Mesh Rundown. If you enjoy movie reviews, short and trailer reactions, you're in the right place. So, want to subscribe and hit the like button down below. Today, we're checking out the trailer for number 75, Annie Hall from 1977. Do you know anything about Annie Hall? Never heard of it. Me neither. So I have literally nothing to input you. Is he creepy for some reason? Woody Allen married his stepdaughter. Oh, yes, okay. When I look at him, I just think creepy. creepy. Yes. And now I know why. Yes. It's like, I know they're not blood related, but it's... he brought his stepdaughter up and then married her. Yeah. It's like sleeping with your child. It's creepy. It's creepy. Woody so... Allen is not my favorite. A relationship, I think, is, is like a shark. You know, it has to constantly move forward or it dies. And I think what we got on our hands <clears throat> is a dead shark. Woody Allen. I love what you're wearing. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, well, it's a, uh, this is a, uh, this ties a present from Grammy Hall. Who? Grammy, Grammy Hall? <laughs> yeah, my Grammy. <laughs> what are you kidding? What'd you do, grow up in a Norman Rockwell painting? Diane Keaton. You don't want me to live with you. How, how, I don't want you to live with me. How, whose idea was it? It's mine. Yeah. Was it, it was yours, actually, but uh, <clears throat> I approved it immediately. Tony Roberts. The one with the VPL. VPL. Invisible panty line. Yeah, she's a 10 max, and that's great for you, because you're, you're used to twos, aren't you? Carol Kane. What, what, what's your name? Allison. You, you're like New York Jewish left-wing liberal intellectual, Central Park West, Brandeis University with the socialist summer camps, and the, the father with the Ben Sean drawings, right? And the really, you know, strike-oriented kind of... Uh, I'm stopping me before I make a complete imbecile of myself. No, that was wonderful. I love being reduced to a cultural stereotype. Paul Simon. We're going to meet Jack and Angelica and have a drink there, and if you'd like to come, we'd love to have you. We can just sit and talk, nothing. Uh, not a big deal. It's just I'm relax, it's just be very really mellow. I, I don't respond well to mellow. You know, I mean, I have a tendency to. If I get too mellow, I, I ripen and then rot. Shelley Duval. I was at the Stones concert in Altamont when they killed that guy, remember? Yeah, were you? I was, I was at an Alice Cooper thing where six people were rushed to the hospital with bad vibes. Janet Margolin, <laughs> Colleen Dewhurst, Christopher Walken in hey, the new Woody Allen, Allen film. Are you always funny? Hey, what is this, an interview? We're supposed to be making love. Annie Hall. No, well, that was the most fun I've ever had without laughing. Annie Hall. Trying to figure out what the significance of it is, because it looks like a movie. It looks probably like people in the seventies enjoyed it. But what was something to make it one of the greatest movies of all time? And above, you know, a lot of the films we've already watched, which were amazing. I just don't get it. I'm not too sure at all. Written and directed by Woody Allen, starring Woody Allen, so he can hit on a lot of bunch of different women. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And make jokes about panty lines because, you know, at 40 <laughs> years old, they're not grown out of that nonsense. Woohoo, I saw a panty line. Woo. Okay. <laughs> like, you're not five anymore. Grow up. I will probably end up laughing in spite of myself at one or two points in the movie. But I don't think it's going to be a great movie. I can tell this is not my humor already. Yeah, it's not. You're not gonna enjoy this at all. Plus, she's way too pretty to date a guy like him. <laughs> what? What does he have? He's not nice to her. So you either need to be good looking and hopefully, you know, nice or at least nice, even if you're not good looking. He's neither. He wrote the script. Yeah, well, that, there that's you go. why. <laughs> But you have to have something to offer a potential partner. What does he have? The ability to write the script where he ends up with the girl. <laughs> so when I said ugly, I don't mean just physically. I mean just everything. <laughs> Other than paying for his ability to hit on pretty woman. No, I'm struggling to see the significance or the reason why this would be on a top 100 list. Maybe the trailer was completely misleading. Maybe it's great, but based on the trailer, wouldn't put it on my top 100 list and not really thrilled to go watch it. Not at all. Let us know in the comments down below. Is this Woody Allen's best movie? Is there something that's better? 
Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.